Right, we're off. Uh, Bernie, uh, tell me what we're all doing here today. There's a five mile race, I believe. Why is it? Yes, Jude, uh, it's quite simple really. About four weeks ago, during public consultations by Dalmady and Gold PLC, they announced plans to develop a toxic processing plant using cyanide uh, to extract the gold from the ore in our local area, which is on this very route which you're taking today. So naturally enough, you can imagine there's a level of fear and tension in this community right now. Why are they afraid or what are they afraid of? They're afraid of the damaging effects that something like this can have on our community, on the environment, on our land, on our air, on our water supplies. Um, and this is a very scenic place. It is. It's an area of outstanding natural beauty, Jude, which you can imagine and you can see for yourself how beautiful it is up here. And, you know, something like this has the potential uh, to t completely destroy everything around it. And all it would take is one disaster and this entire area would be completely wiped out forever. And what are the people who say they're going to, who are the people that are going to do this gold mining? They're Dalry and Gold. They've been here now since 2010, Jude, and they have been on a charm offensive with the local community down in our neighbouring parish in Gorton, uh, trying to essentially give them uh, gifts um, treat them appropriately and you know get them on side essentially Jude um, and by and large that has happened to a certain extent now they were at exploration stage up until last year um, where they are now planning to go for full-scale mining and develop this toxic processing plant and dump in the midst of our community. Who can stop them? Well it's like this it's up to the people of our community to stand up to unite and to say no we don't want this in our area and then we need the support of all of the politicians that are around us to back us in that. And who exactly will make the decision? Is it the Department Council? of Environment? The Department of Environment. Yes, Jude, this is an A1 um, application. There's never been one before of its nature in Northern Ireland or in, indeed in the UK. And therefore it will be something that will have to take place at Stormont with the Minister for Environment. Who is the Minister for Environment? It's Mark H. Durkin at the moment, um, Jude, but as you know, there's an election coming up and we're not sure yet who that will be after that. Was he sympathetic to you? We met with him in Stormont there on Monday, um, the, the 15th of February, and he assured us that there would be a very rigorous processing um, of the application at hand before any decision would be made. Um, he did share in our concerns that we had in the local community and he did say that he would be taking that decision making process very very carefully if it is him at the next stage. I hope you'll succeed. Absolutely. Look, very, powerful, be... very powerful company you're facing. They're a huge multinational company with resources at hand that we could only ever dream of. But what they've underestimated is the resolve within this community to oppose this. Um, there's a very strong community spirit in this area and we're determined that we're not going to let them divide that. How can people help you if they feel sympathetic to your cause? They can research, they can decide for themselves whether this is something that they would want in their area and if not then join us. Join us in saying no. There's How an online petition. That? There'll be more events like this coming up. They can come out and support them um, and if they have any special skills or resources at their disposal we would be more than happy to, uh, to avail of those. And how would they get that online uh, petition? Well, at the moment it's um, under Save Our Sperns website um, on Save Facebook. Save Our Sperns yes. website, so saveoursperns.co.uk? It's actually just on Facebook at the moment, so it is Jude, we'll be moving to website okay. hopefully. Save Our Sperns. Yes, Save Our Sperns. Okay, Bernie, thank you very much. Right. Good luck to you. Thank you very much, Jude.